Hello and welcome to the Birmingham Post Business Bulletin on Friday, January the 15th. I'm Graham Brown. The West Midlands embattled manufacturing sector enjoyed a double boost this morning as two of the region's production firms reported impressive results. Historic cooker maker Arga Rangemaster told investors that its fortunes had improved in the last quarter of last year. That means that it would be turning a profit for the year despite gloomy economic times. The Leamington company has managed to reduce its costs by £9 million over the last two years. And Staffordshire pottery company Port Merion has announced a 34% jump in sales. The stoke on trent company turned over about £43 million last year, compared to £32 million the year before. It admitted that favourable exchange rates between the dollar and the pound had helped, but said that its takeover of Royal Worcester and Spode had added £8 million to its annual sales. You can read more about both of these stories elsewhere on BirminghamPost.net. Meanwhile, there's been more good news for the automotive sector, with European car sales jumping in December. Sales across the continent rose by 16% during the month, which meant they ended the year only 1.6% down on 2008. Elsewhere, President Obama told Wall Street banks they must pay £72 billion back to taxpayers. The President said that he wanted to recover every single dime given to banks in bailouts and criticised bosses for what he described as massive profits and obscene bonuses. That's all from us today. Thanks for watching and join us again tomorrow for more breaking business news. Wow. Wow.